So it finally came my Avengers Phase 1. It has 10 discs, 6 movies collections, and it includes all the marvels of the movie. Iron Man, Iron Man 2, Hulk, Thor, Captain America, and of course the Avengers. At the back you, you'll see what you get inside. The briefcase, the Tesseract, and all of the stuff inside. And if you guys see that, it says Try Me. And once you click that, it kind of lights up. You guys see that? And when it lights up, you can see the Shield logo. So for the release date of this one was September 25, 2012. It was delayed because the Marvel or the Disney didn't have the rights to sell this briefcase outside the country because it was on Germany, I think. They didn't have the rights to sell this one outside of their country, so they kind of lost it for this one. So it got delayed and released on April 2nd. And this is the briefcase. Here's the back. This is the bottom you press to light it up. You guys see that? So once you open it, it kind of lights up. And this is the inside. This is this is the inside of the briefcase. Here's the inside. Avengers. Here's the Tesseract. It's on plastic and it's not heavy. But it's hard. That's how it looks if you put the Tesseract on. I don't know what's inside of this one. There's a screw. I'm not gonna open it though. Yeah, you can see there's a um, buttons in here. Numbers and stuff. But you can't actually click it. So this is what you get inside the Marvel DVD. It has a 3D disc. This is only for 3D disc and the Blu-ray. This is the back Loki. The second one is Thor. Again this is a 3D and Blu-ray. This is the back again Loki on the throne. Next one you get Captain America. The first Avengers. Again 3D and Blu-ray disc. And at the back we'll see Red Skull holding the Tesseract. Next one is the first Iron Man DVD and since this is not a 3D one it only has a Blu-ray disc. The back one is Tony Stark. Next one is the Incredible Hulk and this is the Blu-ray disc. The back one is Abomination. Next one is the Iron Man 2 and it includes a Blu-ray disc. Here's the back one and I don't know what it is. Shield Avengers Initiative and there's a DVD for this one. The back is just the logo of the shield. You'll get this envelope. It says confidential where the shield open immediately. So once you open the envelope, you get this one, which I'm really confused what it is. Is, is this a postcard? I don't know. And then you'll get this key and it has a code on the back, which I don't know what it is for. So you'll get a big plastic, which includes like a file of the agents and stuff. For this one, you'll get a shield and it says security level 7 or above required. You'll get a picture of Tesseract and another one and there's a logo of Hydra. And you'll get this paper and stuff. It's just too much. The next one, you'll see Scarlett Jansen as the Black Widow. Next one, you'll see Jeremy Renner as the Hawkeye. Next one, you'll see this alien and other people and stuff there, there's the alien on the movie and then you'll get this business card by, by Agent Coulson <laughs> he kind of died in the movie so that's pretty sad so next file you'll see Captain America it's kind of small there we go and you'll see like the the logins oh <laughs> they give you the picture of Chris Evans as Steve Rogers, Captain America. His picture is like when he was slim guy. They saw this on the movie. There's a picture of it. So they also gave you one. That's pretty sick. And then you'll see the file of Steve Rogers. Look at his medicals, man. Asthma, anemia, diabetic, color blindness. Oh. And then you'll see this one in the movie where which one he fell applying for army to be a soldier. And it is pretty funny. This is the application of the fraud where it's been to trying to apply everywhere. It says Brooklyn, Bridgestone, Red Bank, New Haven, Paramus. And this is his physical examine sheet. 
and you'll get his drawing on the movie where he draws a monkey and you'll get his this card and another one message from Captain America on the back and you get another one and then you get this picture of Peggy Carter she's Haley Atwell okay next one the file of Agent Romanoff which is Scarlett Jansen as a black widow and says subject to Tony Stark and then you'll get this newspaper cut off of Iron Man you guys see that it's only 50 cents <laughs> that's pretty cool who is the Iron Man oh this is sick man you guys see that it's on the movie too the blueprints of the first suit of the Iron Man they were planning to go to it's pretty sick see this is the first page next one is the weapons and his leg the second one is his body armor and then the other one his shoulder and the legs and you put them together you'll see the perfect suit for the Iron Man can I see that? that's pretty sick they gave you one of the copy and they actually gave you the blueprints of Tony Stark's heart which is our recreator system it's awesome <laughs> and they give you the ex expo which is $24 <laughs> tent of tomorrow Stark Expo <laughs> this is so cool and then they also gave you a Stark Woke Expo brochure which is like a map of the Expo nice you'll, you'll get a napkin for immediate release we no longer make weapons sincerely Tony Stark <laughs> and it says a small letter for this one pepper please post exactly as it is <laughs> This is a cool napkin. And it's actually a napkin. You gotta see that. I think this is the cube, which is the Tesseract. He has like a computation. And then you'll get this business card from Aldrich Killian, which is, is probably gonna be on Iron Man 3 when it comes out next month. I'm so excited to see that one. And yeah, you'll see him in the movie. Aldrich Killian. Next one, this is. Agent Coulson file subject to Puento Artigo. Did I say that right? I don't know. <laughs> oh, this is Thor. You'll get this one when he was hospitalized. <laughs> it says Thor. XX Thor. <laughs> and then you'll get this drawing picture which Thor drew on the movie. And this is the picture where Thor being exiled to the earth. And then you'll see this one which was on the book. And on the back you'll see the Mjolnir, the hammer of Thor. <laughs> and you'll get this driver license of Thor, which is Chris Hemsworth. I love him as Thor. And then you'll get this ID from Jane Foster, which is Natalie Portman. It says physics. And on the back says university. And then you'll see another Agent Romanov, subject to Dr. Bruce Banner which is Hulk and then they gave you another newspaper it says mysterious incident at Culver University laboratory explosion rocks campus they gave you this one and it says Stark Industries and then you'll get this letter from the Nick Fury for the for Bruce Banner and then you'll see this Culver University which you will see Professor Elizabeth Ross and they'll give you this one bingo dose with guacarana kick I don't know is this the juice it says made product of Brazil and then they'll give you a blueprint of the Stark Industries which is the weapon of on the vehicle you see that and they'll give you how the Tesseract 
case maintenance like you guys want to replace the battery on it and they'll give you a certified of authenticity one of a limited edition there's a there's no number on it so I don't know how many they actually made so yeah so that's pretty much it this cost you like 170 but I pre-ordered it before it was actually delayed so I got it for like 159 so like ten dollars difference off so so yeah if you guys love having a collector's edition you should probably get this one but um I, I just love having a collector's edition and put it on my display and but yeah this is 170 if you guys want to get one you'll get those like replicas in the movie and that that I just show you guys but um yeah yeah I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys next time take it easy